Now I'm pretty sure all of YouTube users have heard of Viacom. Some like to call them Viacom. Well, they're a big multinational television and movie conglomerate worth billions. Seems that they've been playing very dirty in their efforts to try to destroy and sue YouTube. As we all know, or most of us do, a couple years ago they sued YouTube for a billion dollars for copyright infringement. Yet now it looks like as the records are being released to the public before this goes to court, but through discovery, that they've been biting the hand that feeds them. They were the ones screwing YouTube, not YouTube screwing them through copyright infringements. This is ridiculous. I think Viacom should be the one being sued. Take a look. If you want to read the whole story, just go to this address and go to the business section or Business Monday as it's called. There's the part about Viacom suing them. And here's the part about how dirty Viacom really is. It says it hired 18 marketing agencies to upload its content to the site. It deliberately roughed up the videos to make them look stolen or leaked. It opened YouTube accounts using phony email addresses, even sent employees to Kinko's to upload clips from computers that couldn't be traced <laughs> to Viacom. And in an effort to promote its own shows as a matter of company policy, Viacom routinely left up clips from its shows that have been uploaded to YouTube by ordinary users. Viacom's effort to disguise its promotional use of YouTube worked so well that even its own employees couldn't keep track of everything it was posting or leaving up on the site. Viacom demanded the removal of the clips that it, it had uploaded, actually, that's crazy, to YouTube, only to return to sheepishly ask for their reinstatement. In fact, some of the very clips Viacom is suing us over were actually uploaded by Viacom itself. Who could be dirtier than that? That's just, oh man, I hate Viacom. Viacom changed YouTube. They screwed it all up to how the good way it used to be, and they and, oh my god, I just can't, I can't even comprehend this, it's so bad. If that's true, it seems inconsistent with Viacom's lawsuit. I advise you guys go online and read this whole story, and copy it and publish it all over YouTube to, to show how disgusting and evil Viacom has been. Money-hungry bastards. Now I hope they don't shut down my vlog channel. Just because I spoke out and told the truth? Keep watching. Day's Farm Rocks.